Broadcasting live from basic land on the plain of Ikoria, this is Tap Tap Concede. Welcome everybody to Tap Tap Concede video version. Mm. Uh, immediately on the heels of me doing a video on the Graham Stark Vlogs channel about how we do those animated <laughs> podcasts and why this episode we come to you myself Cameron and Nelson. Did I even gesture the right way? You can't see my hands. It doesn't matter. Myself, Cameron, and Nelson are all here for the Ikoria Nicknames podcast because we felt like having us actually react to things with our human faces would probably be a better viewing experience for those of you watching. <laughs> yes, our human faces. Yes. I had this one installed yesterday. I found this one on the ground. I... Slightly above a human. I inherited this one from the family line of human faces. <laughs> That's probably the most normal way of doing it, yeah. Thrifty. Um, before we get into it, uh, the show is brought to you, as always, by Card Kingdom. Do check out cardkingdom.com slash LRR for all of your Card Kingdom needs. And you can tell them, loading ready run sent me button, please. And they'll give you a little one-inch button, which right now I believe still says, sideboarding is an admission of defeat. And this show and everything we do is brought to you by you and your kind support of our Patreon at patreon.com slash loading ready run. So this is the Ikoria nicknames episode. What does that mean? Well, for those who have not seen one of these before, um, sometimes magic cards get nicknames naturally, just as a result of uh, your local play community or uh, various people online, you know, certain cards just kind of develop a nickname uh, either when it's spoiled or over the course of playing the format. And we thought, yeah, that's cool, but why should only a dozen cards get that treatment when we could give a nickname to every card in the set? Wouldn't that be brilliant? And uh, as, as we've done for some time now, we have opened this up to community submissions. So uh, thanks to this, this wonderful website that we have now where people can go and anonymously put their, put their suggestions in and then upload the ones that they think are best. And now we come to you and present you with the highest voted results for uh, what what the, you out there suggest that should be the nicknames for every card in the set. Nickname in this instance, sometimes meaning a name that is longer and more difficult to say than just the name of the card, but that's not the point. It's like how GW is actually slightly longer to say than Games Workshop. Wow, yeah. So funny. Unrelated product. Yeah. It's a, and whole, it's a whole additional syllable, isn't it? Yeah, I know. Hmm. Nevertheless. Well, here we are. TY has the same number of syllables as thank you and so on. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, oh, yes, right. And a uh, shout out to um, uh, Stephen, a.k.a. Your Games Be Over for the wonderful uh, nicknames website that we've used for a couple times now and that now has even fancier integration for us, which we very much appreciate. So thank you, Stephen, uh, that we'll be able to take a look at um, momentarily in that I get to actually like advance the cards and everything. And um, uh, shout outs also to Paul, who is acting as our remote tech for this episode. Um, so let's, let us begin, let us get underway. And um, I guess if, if one or other of you wants to start us off with reading the card names once, uh, once the first card comes up. All right. I'll start, Nelson. Adaptive Shimmerer. This, we have a tie right off the bat. We have a tie between Metapod from mm -hmm. Clockwork Cthulhu, which is one of just many uh, Pokemon references, I assume over the course of the set, but just for this card specifically. But I'll give a shout out to BoardGamer52 for the suggestion Counterpillar. Ooh, not bad. That's good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to forever call it Adaptive Shimmerer. Adventurous Impulse. Me. Mom, can we get ancient stirrings? Mom, <laughs> we have ancient stirrings at home. The ancient stirrings at home. <laughs> it's Adventurous Impulse. <laughs> Thank you, Draxus. What if you I... could cast Ponder for five off Llanowar Elves? <clears throat> That's good. Aegis Turtle. Another one drop for High Alert. Mm. The that's new from, best one, yeah. Yeah, that's from Aogan. And there are, I should say, there are many suggestions I'm seeing here just from a brief scan of the page relating to Finding Nemo. The guy mm. Crush from Finding Nemo. Oh, yeah. The, the oh, cool yeah, yeah, sea yeah. turtle dude. Uh, 
but it looks like they split the vote. So it's, this is this is democracy in action, everybody. Alert heed bonder. Uh, Jellyfish Sama brings us the suggestion of he protect, he attack, but most importantly, he give life back. Mm. It's very good. Not bad. Yeah. I, I do also like an anonymous suggestion of I like big butts and I gain some life. <laughs> Because it scans and that's important. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, the, it's yeah. yeah the correct meter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Almighty brushwag. <laughs> three and green plus three plus three. Almighty brushwag. Very Decent. nice. The hmm. first of probably many times I'll be singing today. Thank you to Alter Form for that suggestion. Strong as ten, regular wags, mighty as he. <laughs> 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 anticipate not nicknamed for the first time the yes we've had we've definitely had it before uh there's you know some some recurring ones like uh wait for it or dot 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 patient but for whatever reason the highest voted result is a selection from winnie the pooh by a.a a. milne that says well said pooh what i like best and then he had to stop and think, because although eating honey was a very good thing to do, there was a moment just before you began to eat it, which was better than than when you were. But he didn't know what it was called. <laughs> that's fantastic, actually. That's yeah. great. Yeah, yeah that's thank wonderful. You. Yeah. I think I'm going to use that one. Yeah. Archipelagor. Archipelagor suggests this is just one of several island leviathans. No. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. But I already lose so many drafts. Oh my goodness, yeah. Really do. That was from uh, Noonies. Archipelago, oh, also, oh. by the way, is basically like a nickname already. Hmm. So Yeah, that's true. Auspicious Starix. Want to see me fetch a land? Want to see me do it again? <laughs> it's from Avery the Tiger. I don't know if you've had that experience of, of like your second uh, mutating onto your... Uh, Auspicious Starks for the second time and getting two land. <laughs> Hot diggity. I had a lot of land off this guy. I don't know. I just like the word auspicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, there's a Starx crossing our path. That's a good omen. Ooh. Let's buy some lottery tickets. What an auspicious Starx. Mm -hmm. uh, avian oddity. According to all known laws of aviation, the oddity should not be able to fly. <laughs> From Raber. And I mean, really, looking at the yes. art... I don't know how, I guess if you just have enough wings going fast enough, something's going to happen. I think we can't tell from the art which way it's flying. Yeah. <laughs> like, I mean, maybe the avian oddity just glides. Yeah, yeah, it's going somewhere. It's moving. I see, I see a beak, but that doesn't necessarily imply that the beak is f the direction of flight. Mm. Yeah. Who, who can say? Back for more. So Owlstar99 suggests, guess who's back, back again, and then it's the blank for you to enter the name of that creature is back, tell a friend. Hmm. The friend, I assume, being the opponent's creature that that creature is now killing. Yeah. It's good stuff. Barrier Breach. Where's your god now? <laughs> Hint, it's exiled. No. Says oh, no. Tesla Murrow. It's good. Exactly. Actually, yeah, several people with <laughs> F these gods in particular. <laughs> Ooh, actually, shout out to Ocean Soul as well for Disenchant, Dat Enchant, and the Otter Enchant. <laughs> the, <gasps> the Channel Fireball Events special version mm -hmm. of uh, that nickname. Bastion of Remembrance. I'm not exactly sure how you're supposed to pronounce the um like spongebob alternate caps mockery text but furthest chunk suggests does this go in aristocrats Ooh, yeah and the answer yeah. is yes yes this one does uh i do also like pie bandits second place suggestion of the blood artist gallery Ooh, nice that's good I mean, yeah maybe yeah. just or, or just maybe just the blood art gallery come on down to the blood art gallery Look at all this. Look at all this blood art we got. Isn't we have an great? app. <laughs> we have an app now. Blade Banish. Guest starring The Wanderer as The Wanderer. 
I do like that this was unclear to me when I first saw this because I was like, wait, the Wanderers in this set? And apparently, I don't know where it was, where this lore showed up, but apparently I think it was Vivian mm -hmm. who had... So the Wanderer can't control when she planeswalks. Apparently. Okay. That's, that's the lore. But because all the planeswalkers were trapped on Ravnica during War of the Spark and unable to planeswalk, the Wanderer was able to actually stick around. And she and Vivian got to know each other. And Vivian was like wandering around Ikoria. And then the Wanderer was like, Vorp. I'm like, oh, hey, look, there's the, and she's gone. <laughs> so this is the moment that the, the, she showed up briefly, killed a thing and left. God, that sounds exhausting. Yeah, right? That must suck. Yeah, yeah, she should at least have to stay for like a 24-hour period that can be edited into a 42-minute TV show called uh, Quantum Wanderer, Ooh, I guess. Ooh, I like yeah. it. Yeah. Maybe the next planes walk will be the planes walk home. And then away again. Mm -hmm. Blazing Bolly. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, lava rain causing creatures small amounts of pain. <laughs> Thank you, NSF Mulhern. We're always, I don't know what it is about us here at Loading Ready Run. We're always up for a good chocolate rain reference. Yeah. I mean, my favorite was Maverin Fane. <laughs> Maverin Fane. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> we we went deep on Maverin Fane, too. I remember that. We we came up yeah, with we had a several, couple of lines. several Maverin Fane lines. Yeah. Blister Pelt Gremlin. For <laughs> Blister Spit Gremlin. Sorry. Flem, the Phlegm Flinger. Oh. oh, thank you, Frost Twig, for Flem Flinger. The gross card. Blitz Leech. Uh, Malice, uh, sorry, username Malice suggests teeth, teeth, teeth. I do no also good. like, huh. yeah, uh, DC Wolf 99 also suggests the bleach. Yeah. Ooh, it's not bad. Actually, a couple people suggest if you combine the people that suggested the bleach, that would be the winner. I bet yeah, whatever but... the name for that in German is is sweet. Uh, oh yeah, yeah it's got to be. Yeah. Reminds me of the Goodler from Cons of Tarkir. Yeah. Oh yeah, uh, right, right, right. The Goodul Lurker. Yeah. Yeah, the Goodler. The Goodler. Uh, Blitz of the Thunder Rat. Metal song or magic card? Mm. <laughs> it's very good. Thank you, DC Wolf ninety nine, for that one. Blood curdle. Grandma, why do you have six legs, eight eyes, and several extra canines? <laughs> Asks the gender pirate. Thank you for that. Adorable. Mm -hmm. Bloodfell caves. It's just the one cave, actually. <laughs> From somewhat clever. I personally, I'm always up for a good hot fuzz reference, so thank you for that. True. Blossoming sands. How does sand blossom exactly? From Hyper Mizutsune. That's going to bother me. Yeah. Bonders Enclave. I, uh, I don't know. Okay. You know that secret tunnel song that mm. Alex and Ben always like to reference from Last Airbender? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, the only part of it I know is the secret tunnel, secret tunnel through the mountain. I don't mm. know the, the preamble for it. But the winning suggestion here is the entire lyrics to Secret Tunnel. So I don't know the tune, but it's the, the lyrics to Secret I, Tunnel. I think we can just call it that. Yeah. The entire lyrics to Secret Tunnel. Perfect. Thank you, the Golden Defenders, for that suggestion. Boneyard Lurker. Hey, uh, I've been in the Boneyard for a while now. This is my first time posting. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, War God Mogis. Wow. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That, that took me a sec. I, I very quickly read it and I was like, I don't under. Oh, uh, very oh, good. All yeah. Right. No. One, the Boneyard Lurker must learn to make post. Boon of the Wish Giver. Can grant any wish as long as that wish is drawing cards. Mm. So, to be fair, solid wishes. Yeah. Very good wish. Thank you, uh, War God Mogis, for that one as well. Boot nipper, as if it needs a nickname. I know, right? It's just, yeah, some people just calling it little nipper in here. The uh, the overall that looks like we've we've coalesced on read the flavor text, so I will do that. 
I have a number of hyper specific phobias, and this somehow hits all of them. <laughs> <laughs> I had I admit to having not read that, and that's very good. Flavor wise, this card is such a win that it probably deserved its own little Facebook commercial, like I'm constantly getting from Watsy. It's very, very yeah. good. Who who knew that uh, um, uh, Child of Night just needed the option of having Death Touch? Yeah. Very yeah. good. It's very, very good. It's I I'd say I death touch this one eighty-five to ninety percent of the time. It's hmm. this set too, partly. Like it's a non-human yeah. creature, so those all suddenly gain value more hmm. than sets with child of night. <laughs> Someone is suggesting just calling it a two one with death touch. Actually a couple people. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Cam, child of bite. Ooh. Yeah. Kudos from, from the golden defenders there. Very nice. Or Vu. Yeah. Uh, is it me, Bristling Boar? Yes. No, it's Cam. No, it's Cam. Sorry, it's on you. Let's stay well, structurally in integrated. Hmm. Integrated. Bristling Boar. They call me Mr. Pig. <laughs> From a couple different people there. Thank you for that. I hope everyone knows that the Lion King was referencing the Heat of the Night. It's a I good didn't. movie. You should go watch it. Heat of the Night, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Sidney Poitier. Very good. Anyway. Brokos, apex of forever. Apparently, broccoli. Oh, yeah. over overwhelming winner, broccoli. Someone tried to get fancy with broccoli, apex of leftovers. Not bad. Not in this house. I tell you what, broccoli yeah, never I survives that long. Broccoli. Yeah. Yeah. I, mean, I was always a fan of uh, the sexual chocolate for this one. <laughs> Brokos, sexual. <laughs> there, there's a Dave Chappelle sketch. It's. Yeah. Okay. It lasts about 30 seconds on YouTube, but sometimes you can find it. <laughs> I'm going to also shout out to On and Awful for their suggestion. Brokos, casting this card from your hand. Wokos, casting <laughs> this card from your graveyard. <laughs> we shouldn't have water when we do this episode. Bushmeat Poacher. Uh, it's totally not human. No, sir. Sacrifices a human soldier token says hmm. Raber. Uh, yeah, you can just sacrifice any creature. Yep, that, yep. that makes sense. Mm, Zagoth Terror Pig. I've only just now read the flavor text. A lot of flavor in that Zagoth Terror Pig. Mm. Call of the Death Dweller. Hello, yes, this is Death Dweller. It does kind of have a similar energy facially to the dog from the Hello, Yes, This Is Dog meme. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> the, yeah, the actually. the wide eyes of the uh, hello. Yes, this is dog. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Capture sphere. Uh, as we came up with in the uh, was it Guilds of Ravnica episode? Uh, it's the Pokeball. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, because it just is. It's the Pokeball. What was the name of the guy we had from that cycle of curses in Commander? It does oh. look like that guy, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. What did we get up calling him? Like, oh. was he like the Rube or the Mark or something like that? Is that what we started calling him? No, I know who you're talking about. The first He's name, got... last name. It was like, oh, okay. He had a Brody something. Guy. Yeah. Oh, Brody. Was it Brody? I think you're right. I can't remember. But just always captured seconds before he just catches an enormous beating. <laughs> 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 photos before disaster or whatever it yeah. whatever it is yeah <laughs> all right cathartic reunion here uh act three from cygnus infinity in this case it is act three of the cards in this set act two being the capture sphere though uh i guess uh if if you want to take it out of that context dc wolf's suggestion of friend ancestral recall mm -hmm. is probably pretty good that's hmm. cute mm -hmm. cavern whisperer <sighs> cavern Hmm. Yeah. Blood letter just. Yeah. Mm. I was just thinking of that. That one got me good. That, that one yeah. still gets me good. <laughs> it's really good. Channeled force. Ooh, wheel and deal. Okay. I like mm -hmm. that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Noonies. Because of course you're pitching your hand, you're dealing damage. Wheel and deal. I like Not that to a lot. be confused with the actual magic card wheel and deal. Yes, obviously. Sometimes that happens in the nicknames episode, and it, we just roll with it. Yeah. Yep. Power through. Much like Charge of the Forever Beast. 
Hand attack. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. I appreciate Ooh. that as a nickname. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Thank you, Noonies. And this is this is uh the Zagoth wetlands are fertilized by centuries of Brokos's former challengers. Because that's Brokos. Dealing damage to, I guess, just some sort of dinosaur. Yeah. Yeah. Fair. I guess so. Fair enough. Checkpoint officer. Uh, papers, please. Hmm. Papers, please. <laughs> Several people uh, coalescing on that. Uh, a couple people saying... Uh, of just referencing our show checkpoint with today <laughs> i'm graham and this is checkpoint cheville bane of monsters no one fights like cheville got big knives like cheville no one draws a card and's gain three again and gains three life like cheville there we go sorry nice. for messing that one up that's he good looks, too that's yeah no that scans i like it he looks great in front of giant turtoise eggs <laughs> Doesn't he though? He looks kind of like Jake the Snake Roberts, but like yep. a, a young and very threatening Jake the Snake Roberts. Uh, thank you, Malice, for the uh, guest on rewrite there. That was very good. Chittering Ch harvest. Oh, I'm yep. sorry, Nelson. Oh, Go it's for okay. It. It's okay. Chittering harvester. <laughs> Chittering edict. Uh, other, the second suggestion is just to make a bunch of chittering sounds before pointing at your opponent, which I feel like might result in a judge call. So we'll go with chittering edict. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jellyfish Sama. Clash of Titans. Let them fight. Dot so, gif. It's God, Godzilla, I think. Was it Godzilla? Or yeah, that's it? Shin Godzilla, I think. Yeah, okay, it? good. Because yeah. it, it was uh, Ken Watanabe delivering that line, mm -hmm. I want to say. Mm -hmm. Right. Many, many people coming to that one. Cloud piercer. <laughs> long, long man. <laughs> He's a very tall boy. Yeah. Look at those scale birds. Uh, that was from Sly Guy 46, tied for first place with the Phyrexian suggestion of the Jurassic Park theme poorly played on a melodica. Oh. <laughs> Which, that video. I'm so tired of that. I can't not laugh at it yeah. every time. It gets me. Know. Yeah. Colossification. Oh, Lord. He coming. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's, we've achieved maximum chunk. Yeah. I, 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 I hope like, we have. I do like chonkify hmm. as well. That's There's some too. suggestions there. BV310 with, oh, Lord, he coming. I like, oh, Lord, he coming, especially because it's like, it taps the creature. So we've got a turn here to wait. It's like, oh, he coming. Yep. Everybody knows it's not this game ain't over yet. You you've got to turn. Stand right. back. Convolute. Uh everyone just wants the uh the, the flavor text, which is no, thank you. <laughs> or I guess it's I guess no thank you. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I I enjoy that. I like that. Shout out to whoever wrote the flavor text on convolute. Mm-hmm. Coordinated charge. <laughs> Soldier one. All right. Three, two, one. So, wait. Do we go on one or charge? <laughs> okay. This, there's a there's like the soldier three saying not again. Soldier four saying nothing. Soldier four with a dot dot dot. Evo Quran has written a, a four part a four line script here with these soldiers making sure to coordinate their charge. Um. I also I do like uh, Dynanicus's suggestion of that uh, creatures you control get plus two plus one until end of turn is weird flavor text. <laughs> <laughs> Although I'll say I have won I have won games of of limited with this card because people don't expect this card to actually get cast. Yeah, yeah. No, it's a fantastic card to have like three of in the rescuer deck, right? Yeah. yeah. Corpse churn. We actually matched on Tinder. Oh, <laughs> How did we find each other? The flavor text is, how did we find each other? So there I was exploring a mound of monster corpses. Thank you. BB Swiping for right. For that one. Yeah. Yeah. Crustacean. Mr. Krabs hmm. from Aeogan. Aeogan. Pardon me. Accurate. Crystalline giant. 
Luckily, I brought my D10, D9, D8, D7, D6, D5, D4, D3, and a coin. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Lunatic Panda. I do like RNG Golem, Captain Keyword. These are these are pretty good. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Strider. <laughs> wait, that wait that has reach? Uh, maybe. Nice. <laughs> it nice. Might. Playing to the to the judges there. Mm -hmm. Cub Warden. Don't talk to me or my son or my son ever again. Mm -hmm. From BV310. Very nice. Cunning Night Bonder. <laughs> the name. The name's Bonder, Night Bonder. <laughs> All right. Uh, sure. Yeah, yeah, okay, got me. I'll take it. Who was that? Uh, that was Cygnus Infinity. Not bad, Cygnus Infinity. Mm -hmm. Dark Bargain. <laughs> Bark Dargan. <laughs> <laughs> why, why is that funny? Why is Bark Dargan so funny to me? I just like spoonerisms, I guess. Hmm. I think technically a spoonerism, they have to be real words, but ah, whatever. Bark is a real word. Yeah, there you go. Day Squad Marshal. Fighter of the Night Squad Marshal. Oh, yes. From Noonies. Uh, tied for This is a Knife, which that's a that's a big knife. Yeah, that's a, that's a Bloodborne sword right there. Yeah. Dead weight. Kill the wabbit, kill the wabbit. Math Geek 314, solid Looney Tunes references. We appreciate those too. Death's Oasis. That is beyond our borders. You must never go there, Simba. For the second Lion King reference of the evening and third Disney reference overall, I think. And we're only on letter D. Yeah. yeah. Oh, misclick there. There we are. Dire Tactics. Leroy Jenkins. <laughs> From Hyper Mizutsune. Just Arcan dive on in there. Yeah. Arcanite Reaper. Ho! Oh. Dirge Bat. I have, I don't think I've ever seen this card. Yeah, oh, it's, it's rare. Destroya? Or no, it's not Destroya. It's, uh, I think it has death in the name. I'm trying to remember. You've probably seen the alternate art. There's a Godzilla frame. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, na 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 Flash bat. Cool. Take it. Thank you, Wargod Mogus. Dismal backwater. Florida. Direct to the point. Efficient. I like it. Gets the job done. Thank you, Reinerd. Who may live there? Who knows? Divine arrow. Gideonless reproach. <laughs> Thank you, Thopter Smith Gray. Too soon. <laughs> Draneth Healer. Oh no, I'm going to be late. Puts toast mm. in mouth. He does look like he's really in a in a real hurry. Yeah, uh, this this came up during a, a Profanize match at the PPR. Oh right, yeah. Also, uh, suggestion that with no name associated with it, just the cycle of life. Which is that's that's a, that's clever. That works on a couple a Ooh, couple levels. Yeah. Okay, remember Brody? It's like he sort of has grown up a bit here for this art. Yeah, it's Dranith Magistrate. Hey, guess which zone your commander isn't in? <laughs> that's Ooh. from uh, Noonies. Dranith Stinger. So anyway, I started blasting, <laughs> which I think is our second. It's always sunny reference of the evening as well. I need to watch that show instead of just ingesting it through uh, either uh, image macros, GIFs, or binging with Babish videos. I just let the memes wash over me. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I, I, I know, I just know when is appropriate to offer somebody an egg. That's it. In so, a trying time. Generally speaking, yeah. Uh, that was from Satir Opodobni. So thank you for that. Heck of a name. Dream Tale, Heron. <laughs> I don't know if Dynanicus24 has something personal against this, but it was definitely voted up the highest. So, Shmeem Shmeel Shmeerin. Shmeem Shmeel Shmeerin. Draw another card. Yeah. <laughs> Look at me. I'm a Heron. Oh, I'm winning the game. <laughs> Durable Coil Bug. B bug Bear. Hmm. 
Very good, mm-hmm. Frostwig. I do like also the reassembling exoskeleton. Well, Wait, it was good. it was Frostwig who suggested Bugbear and not Bugbear? Yeah. Poor Bugbear he must be so mad right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Getting scooped. Yeah, exactly. Duskfang mentor. Uh, life coach. Ooh, big evil Dan. Thank you for that. Easy prey. There's always a bigger fish. Hmm. The art in this is fantastic. I'm only just looking at it for the first time. I I love this trope. The the there's always a bigger fish trope mm. of art. You know. Yeah. But uh, that's thinking, not even true. I, I, I that's true. At some point, you do sort of reach. I mean, once you get to sharks, it's yeah. Just you get about, maximum fish. It's, you tap out at that point. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Nunes, for that one. Eerie ultimatum. Oh, that's why he sacked all his things and milled his whole deck. <laughs> says Drake Arden. Rogtalop suggested Pet Cemetery, which is also very good. Ooh. Emergent Ultimatum. That's an awful lot of words to say I win the game. <clears throat> it really is. <laughs> uh, a couple different people suggesting that one. Oh, this is... It, 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 it's a quote attributed to Jeremy White. This oh, is really? been from the North 100 set review. Oh, okay. Okay. That makes sense. Is, is it me? Escape protocol. Uh, astral hide. Let That's good. Astral hide. Yeah. That's good. Thank you, big evil Dan. Essence scatter. I don't feel so good. Mm. From Debatra. Actually, sorry, I guess look down, look back up. Your creature is now butterflies. From Nunes is technically the high vote there. Essence symbiote. Stitch. Says Aww. Clockwork Cthulhu. From uh, Lilo and Stitch, so there we're we're up at four for Disney references now. Is is Stitch also known as Experiment Six Twenty Six? Oh, maybe that, that might be right because right. that one's the number two vote, also from the same person. So I think they're just covering the spread. I've seen yeah. the first five minutes of Lilo and Stitch a couple times, and they definitely <laughs> they don't call it Stitch in the spaceship where it's like created or whatever. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Everquill Phoenix. Phoenix down. Mm. Also from Clockwork Cthulhu. Evolving Wilds. Mutating Wilds. Mm. In the context of this of this set from Debatra. Excavation Mole. <laughs> I knew I should have taken that left turn at Albuquerque. <laughs> Thank you, BB310. Good Looney Tunes. Yeah. Extinction event. A nice Garuda deck you have there. From Frostwig. I guess this would also work with uh, Obosh, Obosh deck. Yeah, yeah which makes it a lot as Obosh. Definitely yeah. the more frightening option, I think. Getting Oboshed. Yeah, that's that was from Frostwig. I do like Nuni's suggestion of Odd the Evens. <laughs> Exuberant Wolf Bear. Name? Wolf Bear. Species? Wolf Bear. Occupation? Wolf Bear. From Clockwork Cthulhu. I, for your reference also, the name is one word, the species is two separate words, and the occupation is hyphenated. <laughs> I like that a lot. Facet reader. Reading the facets explains the facets. <laughs> Dynanicus 24 with that one. Far finder. Ooh, skittering furveyor. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I like skittering for Vair a lot. Thank you, Raber. Yeah. Ferocious Tigerilla. Would you rather fight a tiger sized gorilla or a gorilla sized tiger? From Dynanicus 24. Can we get them to fight each other? Ooh, good idea. Fertilid. M- mutates on top. This bad boy can, ke- can fetch so many forests. Thank you, Father Box. Slap, slaps roof of elemental. Mm-hmm. Fiend artisan. No, Mom, they're action figures. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Wow, yeah. <laughs> it's just uh, his dolls. He's just like, Meh. <laughs> thank you, Lava Jet. Fight as one. The power of friendship. From Avery the Tiger. Hmm. Fire prophecy. The eye of Sauron. From Clockwork Cthulhu. Flame spill. 
Super Duper Death Ray. Yay. Yay. Is Yay. it the same CMC as Super Duper Death Ray? Was oh, it three maybe. mana to deal four with Trample? Is it? I feel like Super Duper Death Ray also has Kicker, doesn't it? No, because uh, Super Duper Death Ray was the one from the unset that just, it was just yeah. damaged. The, the bit was it was damaged with Trample. Is the same mana cost. I <laughs> yeah, think right. it is. It, it is. is. It, is. Oh, just nice. it is the same mana Sweet. cost. Flourishing Fox. They grow up so fast in this meta. Mm. Thank you, somewhat clever. Flycatcher Giraffid. Mlep. <laughs> Spelled M L E P. Mlep. Mlep. BV310. That has to be a subreddit, right? Uh, Mlem. M-L-E-M is one oh. with cats doing the mlem, mlem, mlem thing. Yeah. Right, right, right. Footfall crater. We are looking for blues clues. <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's from a real ham sandwich. Uh, tied also with, so we're looking for a one-legged doggy, roughly the size of a mountain. <laughs> from Ediocracy. Actually, there's a lot of blues clues suggestions in that one. Forbidden friendship. <laughs> Ro- Romeo and Jula Guanadon. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's painfully dweeby, but it landed. It landed. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Dynanicus24. Frenzied Raptor. Clever Girl. Hmm. From Raybeer. Frill Scare Mentor. Uh, menace Mentor. Hmm. Just the Menace Mentor. There we go. Oh, from Big Evil Dan. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Uh, uh, Tesla Moreau suggests, okay, now, to menace someone. Dinosaur screeches, extends frills. Mentor, oh god, never mind. <laughs> not paying attention. Frondland, Frondland Felidar. A different kind of tap tap concede. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Dre Garden. Frost links, cool cat. Mm-hmm. Dynamics twenty four again. Frostvale ambush. Time to chill out from the gender pirate fully grown they grow up so fast from elsie and gopher at instant speed no less yeah why why does is the second play very close second with from noonies is just all caps five dozen eggs oh from a disney movie uh which one beauty and the beast Oh. oh, from that same song we were oh, just singing. Oh, oh. right, that yeah, it? yeah. Oh, Gaston. Right. Yeah. when I was a boy, I'd eat five dozen eggs. To... That seems That's like something too about many getting eggs large. To... Yeah, that's hmm. too many eggs to have in one sitting. Now that I'm grown, I eat six six dozen eggs, so I'm roughly the size of a barge. <laughs> uh, Garrison cat. Give this to Evo Cron with Aristocat. Hmm. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Gem Razor. That has reach. It does. Why? I've absolutely gotten the concede from from uh, people just attacking into Gem Razor. Mm-hmm. I found out it had reach when it highlighted during blocks. <laughs> and you're like, wait, I can block with this? <gasps> this uh, thing is you, bugged. Thank you to Thundershot. Maybe like we're not seeing the action shot in the art and on the back those quills just like extend like vines or something and can shoot mm. into the air. Maybe he can launch them like a porcupine. Yeah, maybe he's actually what is it Bulbasaur or what isn't there one or Ivysaur or something? There's some there's some Pokemon that does that, right? Where it's like the back is a bunch of weird Medusa stuff. Yeah. I think so. All right. Yeah, definitely. General Kudro of Draneth. Some of you may die, but it's a sacrifice I am willing to make. Mm. From old Ben. Uh, Bogdan Sill suggests Otto von Bismarck. (laughs) (laughs) He's the Iron Chancellor, I think. His sister, specific Kudro, was much less popular. (laughs) That's a joke for me. (laughs) I like that one a lot. Ow, that hurt me. Oh, General's Enforcer. I mean, so the, the, the winner for this one is as opposed to the specific Enforcer. So there you go. That 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 one had no name. So instead, I'll shout out to Alter Form for actually it's supposed to be the Enforcer's General. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Welcome to the office of the Enforcers General. Please fill or, out this form. Yeah, is it General's Enforcer or General Enforcers? Mm. Genesis Ultimatum. Is this a Peter Gabriel Genesis Ultimatum or a Phil Collins Genesis Ultimatum? Nice. Says Elaine. Thank you for that. Glimmer Bell. Oh, combos with Colossification. Yep. Mm. From Drake Arden. Gloom Pangolin. Goth Pinecone. <laughs> <laughs> now good. we sing the Gloom song. <laughs> yeah. Thank oh, you, Evo Kron. That's really good. Glowstone Recluse. El Spidro Mutato. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, thank you, Raber, for that one. Go for blood. No, not my blood. <laughs> the Ediocracy. Greater Sandworm. Shai Hulud. Hmm. Is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, yeah, I, I think so. so. From that board game night, that sounds right. I think yeah. Beach thank was you. pretty sure it's Shai Hulud or Ian was, yeah. Thank you, Eogan. Uh, Clockwork Cthulhu also suggests Greatest Sandworm, which I'm a big fan of. Yeah, you're a big fan of that one. I remember mm -hmm. from the last set. Grim Dancer. Grim Fandango. Mm. Very nice. Yes. Uh, Clockwork Lucas Cthulhu. Games. Shout out. All right, Gust we've got one win. so far. Uh, choose one of your opponent's benched Pokemon and switch it with his or her active Pokemon. <laughs> nice. Very mm. good, Mr. Squid. Garuda, Doom of Depths. Against the Odds. Oh. From Nihilus. Thank you. Oh. Hampering Snare. It's a cunning trap, you see. They will attack thinking they have advantage, and then I will cycle this into a good combat trick and blow <laughs> them out. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good. That was thank an excellent you. turn. Like the, hmm. the timing of this joke was fantastic. Thank, thank you, Zath. <laughs> you had me in the first half. Heartless act. Uh, so Avery the Tiger suggests animal cruelty, and hmm. Ediocracy. This is a, a a tie. Is no, don't knight the cat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I like that. Heightened like reflexes. Wait, that was a counter from Cygnus mm. Infinity. Oh, yeah, first strike counters. Helica Glider, <laughs> magic power creep. Now it only takes eight squirrels to kill Emrakul. <laughs> 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 and if they all have first strike, they don't even die. It's not even a trade. Oh my god! <laughs> Thank you, Ori, for pointing out that secret tech. Honey mammoth. So the highest vote is from New Knees, which is Heffalump. Mm -hmm. it's, that's, that's a real Heffalump right there. But I do like Rainier's suggestion of day 258. The bees have yet to notice I'm an elephant. <laughs> <laughs> Hornbash mentor. Hello, students. Welcome to your first day of hitting things really hard. 101. From okay. Gemma Water. Oh, Professor Rumble Crunch. I like that a lot. <laughs> I love Professor Rumble Crunch. Thank you, Dynanicus Twenty Four. Yeah, that has that has strong President Chim Chim energy. <laughs> yeah. Humble naturalist, uh, Radagast the Brown, mm. from Aogan. Hunted nightmare. Uh, turn three into an empty board. Mm. Mirden the wizard. I hate when that happens. Mm. Hunt Master Liger. It's a lion and a tiger? Ikori is so messed up. Nice. I guess this is, strictly speaking, the most normal hybrid on the entire plane, being as we have these. We yeah. shouldn't. We shouldn't, but we have these. Yeah. <laughs> Are, aren't they known for their skill with magic? <clears throat> uh, thank you, Ocean Soul, for that one. Eluna, Apex of Wishes. Your wish for an O3 sloth has been granted. <laughs> uh, that that yeah, so, uh, running yourself into an arboreal grazer would be kind of a kind of a letdown. Mm. Uh, that was from Mister Squid. Imposing Vantasar. <laughs> Open the door, get on the floor. Vigilant cycling dinosaur. Boo. <laughs> Thank you, Lafayette. Hey, that's tied with uh, Chloe's suggestion of cycling one, which is like, yeah, yeah, 
That's the name of this card. Yeah. Indatha crystal. Uh, it's it's an anonymous suggestion, but it's Obzon crystal. Hmm. Uh, yeah, Obzon amethyst from Alyssa Swift. I mean, accurate. Yeah. Indatha triome. And the Obzon tricycle from Drake hmm. Arden. I, I imagine this is the first triomes we've seen. I predict that most of these are just going to be people replacing it with the cons wedge name. But I will see, you know, we'll see how it goes. Insatiable hemophage. That means it eats blood. <laughs> Thank you, Clockwork Cthulhu. Inspired ultimatum. White mana says, I'm helping. <laughs> gain five? Yeah, oh, thanks, White mana. Appreciate hey, sometimes, it. Sometimes the gain five is the most important part of this card and constructed. That's from Idiocracy. Ivy Elemental. We get it. You went to brown. You can shut up about it. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Lion's Eye Diamond. Uh, Gigantha, the wellspring. Gigantha, tap the rainbow. Uh, it's from Avery the Tiger. Also, I want to point out, because I heard Marshall mention this on the Limited Resources podcast, uh, normally on Magic Cards, elk are used as like scale elk to show how big and scary something like a Tarmogoyf is. Mm. Gigantha has its own scale elk. Oh, it's Gigantha's, elk in elk goodness. Yeah, Gigantha's enormous. Come for the elk, stay for more elk. Mm. Um, Jubilant Skybonder. How to train your owl griffin. Hmm. Thank you, BV310. Jungle Hollow. May I offer you an egg in these trying times? That's from Dragon Guy 168. Ah, thank you. There's eggs on the jungle hall. I've never yeah. noticed them before. Look, yeah. there are the eggs. Yeah. Kahira, the orphan guard. Five lords in a, in a trench coat. <laughs> Sorry, that would really caught me. No, that's good. I like it. Ah, thank you, Big Evil Dan. Also, an Azorius win con uh, Azorius control win condition. Yep. Yeah. Even plays offense and defense. Mm -hmm. Keen sight mentor. Well, I do like Ro Rogtalop's suggestion of vigilance vizier, which came in uh, third behind Raber's suggestion of eyes. Uh, the the top suggestion is the Zabumafu photo bomb. Uh, oh, yeah. And that's that's real strong. Thank you, BV310. Hmm. Keep safe. Oh, disallowal. Ah. Oh, nice. Oh, very good news. Yeah. The disallowal. Hmm. Hmm. Karuga, the macro sage. Karuga. I can only ever call it that. Hmm. <laughs> yep. Karuga with three U's. Thank you, Clockwork Cthulhu. Ketria Crystal. Yep, Teamer Crystal, number one suggestion. Two, Teamer Topaz. Okay, Alyssa Swift is going for actual minerals here, and I'm uh, I'm digging it. Yeah, I approve of this. Ketria Triome. Uh, the Teamer Triome, Teamer Tricycle, Soggy Taiga. Pretty good. <laughs> I like that. Uh, Kynan, Bonder Prodigy. The Obligatory Busted Simic Mythic, Ikoria Edition. <laughs> Thank you, Old Ben. Although Mad Cat with the last Air Bonder, that's very, very good. Uh, Kogla, the Titan Ape. Legally distinct King Kong. Mm. Thank you for that. Labyrinth Raptor. And yet another clever girl. Mm. Many, many good clever raptors. That's from some G. Lava Serpent. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, the tough one is just, I can't unsee the top hat. And now neither can I. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh, good for it's you. just like, it, it's that's just not where that goes. That, I know. You, 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 wear, you wear it at the top. It's just like a little, would a lava serpent wear a top hat like this? Or like this? <laughs> oh my God, that's amazing. Lava brink venturer. Never tell me the odds or the evens from Thundershot. Hmm. Lead the stampede. Did Vivian break out the zoo animals again? That's from Rats Gobbler. Light of Hope. 
Swiss Army salve Ooh. from Raber. Very nice. Lord Dracus. <laughs> Another one on this on this meme template. Uh, me, can we have Niv Mizzet? Mom, hmm. we have Niv Mizzet at home. <laughs> the Niv Mizzet at home. Oh. Luca, Coppercoat Outcast. Uh, everything here is pointing towards Joe Exotic and or Tiger King. So, hmm. sorry, Luca. In, in another timeline, you might have had a cooler nickname, but uh, you're Joe Exotic now. I always liked take a look at this deck list. Oh, take a look at this deck list. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Luminous Broodmoth. It's I would just... Also... Go ahead, sorry. Uh, I was also going to say, I would have accepted, like, look down, look back up. Your, your Arboreal Grazer... Or, sorry, no, your Soldier Token is now an Agent of Treachery. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. Uh, Luminous Broodmoth is just Mothra. Everyone's just like, yeah, it's, it's yeah, we're just going to call it Mothra now. Yeah, it probably would have been Mothra even without uh, yeah the connection, definitely. right? Yeah, lurking dread eye, dead eye, uh, kill steel. It's good. Mm -hmm. uh, it's from Noonies. Loris of the Dream Den is casting Black Lotus overpowered. No, it's the companions that are broken. <laughs> says Cheetos and not me. Don't at me. <laughs> <laughs> Lutri, the spell chaser. Otterly banned. Oh. Thank you, Hyrule. Catch you at the crossroads, Lutri. Mm -hmm. Majestic Majestic Oricorn. Now with 1600% more horn. Mm. From Ediacracy. Manted Serval. Main, sorry, main <laughs> Serval. On second thought, let's not go to the ruins of Orn. Tis a silly place. <laughs> <laughs> the flavored text, don't search the ruins of Orn during the day. Nethra's eyes will spot you instantly. Don't go at night either. You'll be dinner for the servals. Maybe just don't go. <laughs> Memory leak. Google Chrome. Mm. By one vote, eking out MTG Arena. Ooh. So... Migration path. Road quest. Mm. Self-referential. Ref I'm drinking sparkling water, by the way. I don't know why I muffed that one up, but thank you, Ocean Soul, for the road quest reference. Migratory great horn. R rampant goat. <laughs> mm. Is you, you're, surely, surely one of us in our, would, would have rampant goats on our... Yeah, on our, uh, our family crest. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, mine is a stump, but I'd right. be willing to see rampant goats to anyone else. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Noonies, for that one. Momentum Rumbler. Are you ready to rumble? Suggested anonymously. Hmm. Monstrous, monstrous Step. Please, no Steppy. <laughs> From Noonies. Baby <laughs> Bicycle also with Big Steppy. So, Moscote Goriak. I think this is intended to be pronounced. Hmm. It's just B U and then a whole bunch of H's from Raber. Somewhat clever, it just says Benjamin Wheeler open mouth noise. So I don't. <laughs> yeah, that's that's about. I think you got it. All right, cool. Yeah, it's like a non aspirated honking noise. <laughs> The Highlander community is pretty into big, you know, pigs and cows. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> like something like that. Mutual dis destruction. Witness me. Mm -hmm. From Alter Form. Although uh, De Butter suggested Bone Sprinters, which is also good. Ooh. Mysterious. May I offer you mm. an egg in these trying times? Close. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> but far and away the number one vote. Can I offer you an egg in these mysterious times? Okay. Oh, from Noonies. I should have been able Clever. to figure it out without reading the name. Yeah, yeah. Mystic Subdual pulls out blackboard. Let's talk about layers. Because <laughs> what's the thing with this is that it can't if you put this onto a creature with a mutate on a, on the stack they don't get the when this creature mutates triggers 
Mm, right, and it has flash. Sorry, I don't worry about I, it. I don't want to take this judge call right now. Uh, and oh, the minutes. second I yeah. tell you what, the second suggestion on the list is mutate works in layer one because of course it does. So <laughs> okay. you know, don't worry about it. Mythos of Brokos. Uh, there's nothing to say except you're welcome from Rainier. Mythos of Aluna. Spider-Man pointing at Spider-Man from Drake Dr from Drake Arden. Mm -hmm. Mythos of Nathroi. Mythos of elegant yet confusing wording. Mm. It, it, it's very elegantly written, yeah. and it, I have to read it four times at least every single time. Like, it's just know, new. It, it's new wording. Like it's different, so it really does make you read it. Is it is it actually new, or is it just like or 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 very rarely used? How syntax need to be. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Hmm. Anyway, thank you, Dinonychus, for that one. Mythos of Snapdax. Coria's oldest cat meme. <laughs> Wow, yeah, yeah. And Tesla Murrow. Sorry, Ediocracy Ed says, and lo, the humans were distraught as Snapdax won the Sandcastle competition. <laughs> Mythos of Vadrock. Ha ha, removal spells go whirr. <laughs> Spelled W-U-R-R. -R. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah, it's, that's real good, Noonies. You, you, oh. got a knack, you got a knack for that. Narset of the Ancient Way. Narset of the kicking her own mana cost. Mm. She's just kicking that red mana right out of there. That's how they uh, did it back then. Yeah. Thank you, Dinonychus. I'm glad she got back her full Jeskai. Yeah. Necropanther. Crypt of the Necropanther. Or tied with Magic Carter Metal Band. Hmm. Surely there's a metal band called Necropanther, right? They're, they're probably a Pantera cover band and they suck. Oh, oh you're so right. Thank you to Butter for that suggestion. Nethroi, Apex of Death. With this, I can bring back as many Ornithopters as I want. Finally. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Raybeard. Neutralize. Can cycle. Oh, ooh, yeah. ooh. Yeah. that's mm, that's tasty. I like it. From War God Mogus. Night Squad Commando. <laughs> Fighter of the Day Squad Commando. <laughs> I think BV310 got in on both of those. Mm. Uh, I also do like Mardu Horde Chief 2, Electric Boogaloo from Sly Guy 46. Very nice. Ooh. Oh, Bosh, the Prey Piercer. I can't even. Ja, ja, ja. From De Butter. Thank you for that. Of one mind. Two worlds. One family. I don't know what that's a reference to, but thank you, Noonies. Hmm. Offspring's Revenge. My, my name is Inigo Patoya. You killed my father. Prepare to die. <laughs> thank you. Several. Actually, Inigo Miontoya... My name is Simba. You killed my father. Prepare to die. We're getting a lot of like pop culture mashups going on in here. Very good stuff. Ominous seas. Wheel, wheel ease the kraken. <laughs> we, we, wheel ease the kraken. I guess the Ooh. person has to have a really big like speech. Wheel ease the kraken. Mowage. All right. Thank you, Nunes. Pacifism. Turn to stoned. Mm. <laughs> Thank you, Nunes. Parcel beast. R risen beef. <laughs> ah! That <laughs> took me a second. It wasn't until I said it out loud that I realized it was it rhymes with risen reef. Mm. Mm -hmm. Just like mm -hmm. risen beef. I don't, I get it. Okay. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Punny? Puny? Thank you. Either way. Patasia tiger. Uh, the flyger. From Big oh. Evil Dan. The first time I saw this, I just said the Pataiga Taiga. Nice. Mm. Mm -hmm. But that wasn't on the list. Perimeter Sergeant. 
This right here is what we call a ruthless monster attack. It could happen to anyone. It could happen to you. Call 1-800-MONSTER today to buy your anti-monster combat tricks. Order today and get a one-mana cycler completely free. <laughs> it, does look like he, it does look like he's going, hey, see here, you see all this happening behind me? You want to avoid this. And the best thing is perimeter sergeant doesn't pay for the uh the 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 the, the one man the cycler unless he really really believes in it. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Thank you, Zath. Phase dolphin. Sorry. Uh, not, not a dolphin. Does not have phasing. Just taking just apart dolphin. Yeah. Just to summarize the top three results. Mm. Plume, as is tradition. Yes, <laughs> that's the first several results for for plummet is indeed plume. Polywog symbiote. Hi ho, Kermit the Frog here. Hmm. It's like I forty six. I love this little guy. He's a good. He's a good little guy. Porky parrot. <laughs> Porky parrot. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there's also, I mean, there's several suggestions that are just this is already a nickname. But uh, Big Evil Dan has Polly Pinger, which is pretty mm -hmm. good. Uh, a real ham sandwich suggests what? existence is pain. So you know, <laughs> that one's up there too. Nice. Pouncing shore shark. Street sharks. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Clockwork Cthulhu. <laughs> Land shark. I would always just could have called this one pouncing shark. Dude, sorry. Dude. Prickly sorry. marmoset. Uh, <clears throat> no blocks. Mm. From Boros Charm, target you. Primal empathy. Uh, humans will pack bond with anything. From Noonies. Proud will wild bonder. Super trample. Mm. Also from Noonies. Although I do like Idiocracy saying, just wait until he's fully grown. Oh, I get it. Yeah. Pyroceratops. All Triceratops can be a Pyroceratops, just not for very long. Mm. I like we've it. Been, we've been running these experiments before we got shut down. We were running these experiments. And <laughs> thank you, Mr. Squid, for that one. Quartzwood Crasher. I hit that guy so hard a dinosaur fell out of him. <laughs> <laughs> Creatures uh, you control with trample have dinosaur link. <laughs> <laughs> That's good too. <laughs> Thank you, Noonies and Pyrox, respectively. Raking claws. Oh no, my sleeve. Duh. <laughs> Thank you, BV310. Ram through. Hello, Galta, my old friend. Mm. I've come to wreck with you again because a vision of Green Stompy left its seeds while I was brewing and the vision that was planted in my brain still remains with a swing for lethal. Mm. Gotcha. Sorry, that got away from me at the end there. But uh, yes, mm. Very, it's real good is ram through. Probably good with Galta, yes. Rogren Crystal. The Jeskai Jewel. Mm. Ah. Nice. Rogren Trial. Uh, yep. Jeskai Tricycle. The Jeskai Tricycle. Number one beach vacation destination in the multiverse. Does look nice. The beach episode. Mm -hmm. Reconnaissance mission. When scouting pays more than piracy. Mm. From Alicander. <laughs> Sorry, Gemma Waters said, uh, there's some big effing monsters down there. <laughs> <laughs> that was like the Canadian version. I like it. Yeah. Regal Leosaur. <laughs> Legal Reosaur. <laughs> sure. Love it. Love it. Please call me Regal. Mr. Leosaur was my father. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Blue Mechanic. Reptilian Reflection. We get a lot, culturally, we get a lot of mileage out of the old Spice commercials. Uh, look down, look back up. My do-nothing enchantment is now a dinosaur. Mm. Thank you, Raber. 
Uh, actually, Father Box also suggests objects in the rearview mirror may be closer than they appear. <laughs> Must go faster. Mm -hmm. Riel the Everwise. Riel the Wheel Deal. Hmm. Oh, a lot of wheeling wheel and dealing. A lot of wheeling going uh, on, yeah. That's set. Uh... Rooting Moloch. Recycle. Ooh. Yeah. Some G. Actually, you know, Nelson, we could just call this uh, Rocky. Oh, okay. Because he's the recycle pup. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Dad jokes. Don't lose it. Reuse it. Yeah, that's that's what a dad joke actually is. The rest of these are just puns. Yeah. Dad no, jokes but... is just like referencing the shows our children watch. Yeah, and going for a real groaner sometimes. Yeah. Rugged Highlands. Strawberry rock candy. Mm -hmm. Those do yeah. look tasty. Looks delicious. Yeah. yeah. Ruinous ultimatum. V Violent ultimatum. Who are you? Ruinous ultimatum. I'm you, but stronger. Hmm. From Noonies. Rumbling rock slide. We will rock you. Mm. War God Mogus. Sanctuary lockdown. Shelter in place. Mm. From Noonies. Yep. yep, quarantine, social distancing, also wash your hands, global pandemic. Yep, all right, everyone's everyone's on track here. Sanctuary Smasher. Kool-Aid Kaiju. I don't get it. But, oh, because it's breaking oh, through. Bring it down. Oh, yeah, gotcha. Oh, all right. no. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you, Hyper Mizutsune. Savai Crystal. Uh, Mar Ooh, do we like Mardu Mineral or Mardu Malachite? Those are both good. Malachite's greenish. Hmm. But Which it's also a weirder word. Yeah. I mean... I like all of it. It's yeah. Weird. It's... Hmm. Savai Sabretooth. Uh, Blade of the Sixth Savai. Hmm. Savai Thundermane. Lightning Felix. Hmm. <laughs> awesome. It's very good. I love it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Savai Trial. Oh, sorry. Uh, Pride Rock. Or the Mardu mm. Tricycle. Or the uh, reading here, is this changed in any way? Uh, the lyrics to Circle of Life? Uh, oh, they are actually. From the day we arrived on the set's plane and blinking stepped into the sun, there's more to mutate than can ever mutate, more to do than can ever be done. Some say threat, some say threat or cast threaten. Some say live fast and live. But all are agreed as they join the stampede, you must never take more than you give. In the cycle of life, it, oh. it it's the wheel of fortune. It's the leap of faith. It's the abandoned hope. Till we healing grace on the clock unwinding. It In the cycle, the cycle of life. Very nice. Okay, nice work. Thank you, DeWord. Sorry that I performed that like slam poetry, but I didn't really feel like I could hit the right notes there. Scammer Barrett. It's coming at me from all angles. Uh, Shadow of the Colossus Landscapes. Mm. It does look like that. Hyper Missy. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Sea Dasher Octopus. Ninja of the Deep Waters. Which says, thanks to Kate's Crate on Reddit. So I guess mm -hmm. someone tr transposed that for us. And thank you. I always like Ben, uh, ben Wheeler's take on that, which is like, okay, this Ophidian is good, right? <laughs> this one has to be good. Yeah. Serrated Scorpion. Wait, this doesn't have Death Touch? I tell you, I've given it Death Touch more than a couple times, and it's great with it. It's what the? Music. Yeah, right? I've let this through for so much damage. <laughs> well, no, that's a lie. But I've let it through more than I should have. <laughs> it's really good to hit with Call of the Death Dweller, and then you give it Death Touch. And mm. then, then it's even better, yeah. Shark Typhoon? I mean, it's, it's Sharknado. It's just it's, uh, sh 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 Sharknado. I think that might be the first time I've called it Shark Typhoon. I just, when I see it on, on camera or whatever, watching the, the Arena Match Fest Online matches, I just call it Sharknado because the picture is too small to remember would, that it's called Shark Typhoon. <laughs> I would have to think about it. If you were like, hey, what's the name of that Sharknado card? I'd be like, I. Yeah. I mean, this must have been called Sharknado until seconds before being published when somebody <laughs> had pulled up thesaurus. 
Yeah. Right? Like, legal says we can't call it Sharknado. Oh, fine. Shark. Cyclone? No, that's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Shredded sails. Uh, that's a weird way to template a charm. I like this because, yeah, it's choose one. Destroy a target artifact. It deals four damage to target creature with flying or you cycle it for two. There you go. Just like Azorius charm. Yeah. It's from, that was from Cygnus Infinity. Thank you for that. Skull, skull. prophet. Sorry. Uh, step one, skull. Step two, mm. step three, prophet. Mm. Always up for a good underpants gnome joke. Mm. Thank you, Malice. Skycat Sovereign. Pride of the Clouds. Hmm. Which was a... Was that from Dissension? Yeah. Yes. Hmm. Very similar card, yeah. But it had forecast. Sleeper Dart. No, it doesn't tap. Oh! Wow, I've been misreading this card the whole time. I've never played it myself, but yeah, okay. Sacrifice Sleeper Dart, target creature doesn't untap. It does, okay, good. That's, Thank you, Lunatic Panda. To... Man, could you imagine if a Trank Dart didn't actually knock uh, a dangerous animal unconscious? It just made it fall asleep for longer? Yeah, you gotta wait till like, it's already asleep, then get it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that sounds like a really great product. Can I get this? <laughs> no, wait, that's just melatonin. <laughs> <laughs> got a trademark on it. Uh... No, no, your opponent loses the life from Raber. You draw a card, each opponent loses one life. We're getting a lot of really good information about reading the cards here. This card Bob's wrong. I know. Snap Dax, Apex of the Hunt. So the top couple are Spandex, which is mm -hmm. the one James did. Uh, what did. What did you call it, Nelson? I thought I was going to call it Spandex, too. Oh, or, did you, you, didn't you call it snack snack dance? Snack, dance? Right. snack yes, what did I, did I say? Sorry, snack packs, I think. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. Cam. Yeah. There's an anonymous suggestion here for Curzon, Jadzia, Ezri, and Snap. <laughs> the line of Dax. Nice. Ooh. Ooh. There's other there's other ones in there. Well, uh, Jiraiya, Tobin. Hmm. Uh I don't I don't know all of them. Was, was Tobin the murderer? maybe hmm. I don't know that was a weird episode yeah anyway snare tactician snare taptician cha -cha. worth worth my snare I have no snare in my head oh, I have no snare in my head solid footing <laughs> <laughs> sorry Mr. Squid suggests the art description show a woman standing there but like really standing there. Mm. <laughs> Song of Creation. Wait, how many cards do I have left in my draft deck? <laughs> Thank you, Father Box. Sonorous Howlbonder. Me Menace à toi. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I like, I like that. It. I yeah. like it. Thank you. Thank you, Noonies. Spell Leader Wolverine. This thing, sorry, mage, mage one, this thing literally eats lightning and craps thunder. Mage two, you mean figuratively, right? Mage one, I do not. <laughs> <laughs> From Tesla Murrow. Splendor Mare. I mean, antlers are technically different than horns. Mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Because oh, it's an elk it's unicorn. unicorn. I see. Yeah. It's got both. Gotcha. Thank you. Somewhat clever. Spontaneous flight. Mozilla Firefox. Hmm. This is from Noonies. Lunatic Panda says, this is like the biggest possible failure from the perspective of teaching her to sit. Because <laughs> <laughs> the flavor text is amazing. And I was only trying to teach her to sit. And it's like, <laughs> you, then you, you got, you failed so badly. <laughs> yeah, this is disastrous. You might get the chair for this. <laughs> Spring Claw Trap. You've activated my trap card. We got There's, there, everyone. We finally got, got a Yu-Gi-Oh reference. It took until S, but we got there. <laughs> Thank you, Ori. 
Sprite Dragon. Uh, is Sierra Mist Dragon okay? Mm. Oh, <laughs> Fresca <laughs> Dragon. <No>. Yeah. <laughs> So is Seven Up Dragon okay? Very good. Thank you. Also, Fine, I'll have the Mister Pib. Oh. <laughs> Lime Bubbly Dragon. Yeah. Startling development. One morning, Gregor Samsa awoke to discover he had been transformed into a four-four blue serpent. Hmm. I love how confused it looks, especially the eagle. The eagle's like, I don't know how to deal with this. This is something wrong with baby. Yeah. Thank you, Nunes. Stormwild Caprador. The unboltable bird. <gasps> Thank you. Thank you again, Noonies. Sudden spinnerets. <laughs> spider deer, spider deer, does whatever a spider deer does. Can he swing from a web? God, I hope not. <laughs> now I want to look up what happened to that company that was trying to splice the genes for spider silk into a goat, so they lactated oh. spider silk. Right. I remember that. It was weird. They, if they had a license for whatever they were doing, I hope they don't have that license anymore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They were like, mm, mm, mm. No, thank you so much, like clever. It. Suffocating fumes. Hot boxing. Mm. Alternately, now the air needs cycling. <laughs> From uh, Cygnus Infinity and Debatra tied for first there. Mm. Survivors bond. I don't think you get to call yourself survivors if we have to fetch both of you from the graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> I think Riley Knight might have made that same joke on stream. That's that's week. good. I think it's getting around. Yeah, yeah no, I like Thank that. you, Lunatic Panda. Swallow hole. Ah, yes. B eats the whole thing. Mm. Excellent. Good. Thank you, anonymous person who didn't want to put your name on that. Swift water cliffs. As opposed to water that falls off of a cliff very slowly. Mm. <laughs> Thank you, Frost Twig. Tentative connection. Come on, spit it out. <laughs> Come on. Spit out. Out. It really does look like he's going, give it. Give, give it back. Give my keys back. <laughs> it's just like a, a tennis ball, but like a normal sized tennis ball somewhere in that mouth. Mm. Mm hmm. Thank you, Drake Arden. The Ozolith. <laughs> Drood the Ozolith. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Love it. I knew someone who used to get Ozoliths all the time. Oh, man. Thieving Otter. Untitled Otter Game. Hmm. Nice. Thornwood Falls. If a Thornwood Falls and no one is around to hear it, does it gain a life? Excellent. Not bad. Not bad. Classy. Uh, Ocean Soul, but credit to the other guy whose nickname I finished, because the second place is If if a Thornwood Falls No One's Around to Hear It, from Zath. So thank both of you. Ooh, nice. Thwart the Enemy. <laughs> Be Beagelander Playable. <laughs> oh. oh, I lost a draft game to two of these. Really? <laughs> Sorry to say, yeah. Wow. Oh, that is a brutal. shame. I think I got to seven in that draft, too. <laughs> oh. Titanoth Rex. I'll chump block. No, you won't. Mm. From Noonies. I do like Hyrule's suggestion of, run, it's Godzilla. No, no, it looks like Godzilla, but due to international copyright laws, it's not. <laughs> Which I think is a Simpsons quote. Titan's Nest. Delve is a fair mechanic. Mm. Thank you, Ori. Tranquil Cove. Please don't go to the beach right now. From Drake mm. Arden. Trumpeting Gnar. So the top one is Gnar, which I do like. But I all, mm. I'm also a big fan of huh. I never really uh, appreciated that Gnar might have actually just been an onomatopoeia for this animal. Yeah, Gnar. 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 What do you call those? Well... I think Nar means the the, the village. Uh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Deep cuts. Umori the collector. Choose land for dominance. <laughs> <laughs> From Clockwork Cthulhu. Unbreakable bond. A wholesome black card. Hmm. It's like a it's like an, a giant 
pangolin raccoon. It's adorable. Yeah, I want one of these. Some kind of like armored tanuki. It's great. Unexpected fangs. Surprise vampire. Mm. The board gamer. Look at the face on that dinosaur, by the way. It's like, it's like, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, gross. Unlikely aid. This is my new child. From Reinerd. Unpredictable cyclone. As opposed to all the predictable cyclones. Hmm. From Noonies. Rocktalop also with Possibility Cyclone. Oh. Vadrock. Apex of Thunder. <sighs> Thunderstruck! Mm -hmm. I'm not that guy. I can't do that guy's voice. Only uh, that guy can do that guy's voice. No, no, no. Da, da. Yeah. Uh, as as heard faintly in every high school parking lot for a good solid 20 years. Oh, man. I had to listen to it every day at work. My first job I had doing uh, prep cook and dishwashing. <laughs> I was going to ask. Yeah. I was going to ask. Boston was, Pizza was, playlist. Yeah. It's just like, yeah. Was this faintly it. it was faintly audible uh, from emanating from dish pits. Yeah. And from a Trans Am in a high school parking lot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It got played at least once at all of our dances. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, I do like that was from Malbeam. I do like Nuni's suggestion of the bird that bolts. It was also very good. Mm hmm. Valiant Rescuer. Hero of Precinct Run. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, you, Luna, yeah. Thank you, Lunatic Panda. That, that's, that's very good. This is like the hit. It's funny, too, because that, that, that card has been getting a bit more play than Hero of Precinct 1 lately. Yeah. Mm. And, mm -hmm. and it's like, an, you know, it's an uncommon. It's not as pushed to mechanics, sort of. Uh, anyways, Vivian, Monster's Advocate. Uh, if I may play Monster's Advocate from Mother Willow, uh, tied with, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Vivian Reed, and my client, Kolgla the Titan Ape, <laughs> conquered General Kudrow's undefeated streak at Behemomania. <laughs> nice. <gasps> Very nice. Void Beckoner. A statement on Space Godzilla. Mm. Nice. Space Godzilla, the unfortunately named uh, Space Godzilla. Mm. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 yep, mostly that. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Voracious Great Shark. Here you go. Counter Shark. Do, 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 do. Also, I imagine there was a lot of like, I'm a shark. <laughs> you, weirdly, because I love that cartoon. I'm not seeing, yeah, I'm a shark. I'm a shark. It's even making the mouth. Suck my D, I'm a shark. Yeah, I don't see that one. I do see, you know, Jaws. Uh, we're going to need an uncounterable boat. Do, Spell, do. Spells our friend, not food. That's not bad. Do, do. Yeah. Vulpakeet. Fox McCloud <laughs> from Malbeam. That is, in second place, anonymously, it is straight up a Pokemon name. Mm, mm -hmm. Definitely. Mm -hmm. We're going to see that someday. Weaponize the monsters. Step one, find a monster. Te step two, put the monster in the catapult. Step three, find another monster. <laughs> that is the, uh, it's the flavor text from, I want to say, Orcish Cannoneers or, or some oh, sort of, yeah. or like spell catapult or something like that. Yeah. It's the flavor text from another magic card. It's like find a goblin. Post. It's find a goblin. Yeah. 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 Uh, bu -bu Whirlwind of thought. Thinking up a storm. Mm. Uh, from Cygnus Infinity with, uh, tied with, what's the sound of one card drawing? Mm. From some G. Whisper Squad. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'll do it. I'll just do the nickname for you. <laughs> squad. Yeah, that was it. That was definitely it. With the vast, far and away, just Squad. I do way down the list just because it's different. I'm going to mention Lunatic Panda's suggestion of you'll never beat me because I'm actually four blokes. <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh. Will of the All Hunter. Not to be confused with Tim of the All Hunter. Hmm. <laughs> Boo. From Zath. I'd be very interested in reading Snapdax Will. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I snapped axe of sound mind and body. <laughs> to Brokos, I leave my teeth. You always seem to have problems with them. I don't know. On the condition that she is unmarried at the time of my death, I bequeath <laughs> most of my lands. To Vivian, the monster's advocate. Yeah. <laughs> well, we'll sorry, go ahead. Yeah. My stabbages. <laughs> 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 You okay? <laughs> Thank you, Reinerd, or I guess Reinerd's friend. I just my stabbages really caught caught me yeah, off guard. Man, it's good. It's good. Windscarred Crag. Oh, this one's Pride Rock for sure. This mm -hmm. one's this mm -hmm. one's Pride Rock from this, Piper. This one is finally yes. Though I yes. do also like the second place. Don't mention the wind to Craig. He was deeply scarred as a child. <laughs> Wingful Teron. <laughs> Reminder that this episode of Tap Tap Conceit is brought to you by you over at our Pateron. <laughs> Thank you, Cygnus Infinity. <laughs> Love it. Wingspan Mentor. Flight Instructor. Hmm. Big Evil Dan. Alternately, if your best friend jumped off a cliff from Cygnus Infinity. Well, he would fly. Yeah. Winota, Joiner of Forces. Winota Rider. Hmm. She does look a bit like Winona Rider. Yeah, I I would be shocked if it wasn't an unconscious thing. Yeah, yeah. Even. Thank you, Malbane. Yadaro, wandering monster. There are monsters in this set. <laughs> I move the oh lord he coming counter to three and end my turn. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Ori. And thank you, Evocron, for Gamera, because I believe this one's Gamera. Hmm. Yorion, Sky Nomad. So uh, what's, what's the land count for an 80-card deck? It's about mm. 35. 36 is good. Yeah. There you go, Father Box. Now you have the answer. Zagoth Crystal. I'm casting a spell. Okay, animal, vegetable, or mineral. <laughs> <laughs> that was from Noonies. Also, we uh, Saltai salt salt Sapphire from Melissa Ooh. Swift. There we go. Even the right color. Yeah. Zagoth Mamba. Ladies and gentlemen, I just drafted Mamba number five. Da, 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 da. Well, that'd be a good deck. Yeah. A little bit of mutate creatures. Yeah. Zagoth Triome. Ooh, Debatra with the Bug Bog. Ooh, B U G. Decent. That's that's Decent. that's good stuff. Zenith Flare. Cycling Helix from mm. Evocron. Very nice. Or just and... a deflated sounding Zenith Flare. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Zerda, the Dawn Waker. Oh, maybe this is Firefox. Because mm. that's the, all the top suggestions are all Firefox. Well, I guess this one's Firefox. The other one is a different Firefox, I guess. Yeah, we oh, can. Oh, that was it. That, oh. that was the last card. Yeah, Zerda's the last card in the set. And we can go with the previous nickname of... Uh, actually, if you were trying to teach it how to sit, mm -hmm. this is disastrous for you. Yes, exactly. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Well, there we are. We did it. Thank you, everybody who suggested nicknames and everybody who helped uh, vote for them as well. Because, I mean, there's no voting without everyone else as, uh, and we had way more people doing it this time than last time um, and uh, we'll do it again for the next set um, but yeah thank you all these were really funny and uh, we we really appreciate uh, your involvement shout out again to Stephen for making this great website for us and uh, to Paul for uh, running tech on this episode we'll probably be back to, to, to the animated ones for uh, next episode but we felt like this one you know you, we want to see us all falling about and getting totally got by puns and everything. So um, uh, we are brought to you by cardkingdom.com slash LRR, which we really appreciate you checking out. And of course, our wingfold Patreon at <laughs> pteron.com slash loading ready run. Um, but that's going to do it for this week. So uh, thank you. Which way am I facing? Thank you, Cameron. Thank you. And no. thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, Nelson. Thank you. Your games be over, and everybody, thank you. And we can't, we do not have this worked out. And we will uh, talk to you all next time on Tap Tap and See. Bye, everybody. Bye.